Hey everyone, this is Windows XP Help, and I'm gonna show you uh, some um, notepad tips tr and tricks. Um, yeah, so um, Notepad it's a program, but you don't have to download it or install anything. Um, it comes with Windows XP, Vista, and probably Windows 7. Okay, so um yeah um the first trick is um i think most of you might know this it's called bush hit the facts um just type in bush hit the facts you type it in you type this in in notepad it's the exact you have to type this in exactly or else this trick won't work so if um after you type in bush is the facts um go to file click save as and then save it to wh wherever you want i'm just going to name it bush onto my desktop and click save okay and i got this right here I just double click on it and I get I should get a Chinese characters I think it's Chinese um but I don't have the Asian um, Asian language code um, thing installed on this computer because I recently um, reinstalled Windows XP so yeah um yeah so you should get a chinese letter stuff that will and yeah so for that's the first trick the second trick is um oh, i can't show this to you because my notepad's messed up i don't know why but yeah so um, so um the second trick the, um, I'm just going to move on to an next tri another trick. Um, you can make fake viruses out of with Notepad. And, yeah. The first fake virus you can make is just simple uh, um, Visual Basic script error thing. Just type in A equals, A equals message box msgbox parentheses this thing um an error occurred um yeah just that that's gonna be the like the um like the description of the error then just get a comma put 16 and you can replace that to with any number between 1 and 64 I think and you will get more and that number will change um, like the icon next to the uh, error and how many like buttons and what buttons so um make another thing I don't know what's called then put error um, and that will be the uh, title for the um, error and then put another parenthesis here and then uh, save it click save as and type in um, error.vbs and then save it onto your desktop so yeah and you'll get something like this a green thing in the uh, file with a green thing in the middle. Middle. Uh, just double click on that, and you you'll get an error. It's just a fake error. If you wanna make a continuous like error message box, you just copy this line. Just go to edit, and then click copy, or you could just 
hit control C and then I paste it okay that, that was a mistake paste it hit enter paste enter paste enter paste enter paste and then you just save and then um you get this well you won't get this because I only saved so I'm um, just click on this and you get one error if you I've click if I click OK I'll get another error then click then um, I have five because I only put five error thing right here and yeah and if you wanna do a prank on someone you could uh put you got pranked or something and you could the title I'm just gonna name it haha -ha. then save and open this up you get four errors one two three four and then you will get this haha -ha message you got pranked and then if you click OK or an X, you, it will like disappear. Okay, so that's another trick. And the third trick is you can make like a really, really harmful virus with Notepad. Um, um, for example, you can make you can make uh, Echo Echo um virus just make an at mark e c h o oops caps lock okay and please do not try this at home I, I will take no computer damage responsibilities actually I want to show you this because I don't really want to get in trouble but if you want to try prank I'm um, doing a prank on someone just type in echo uh, echo off and then shit okay and then um uh just type in stuff you could yeah um i'm really tired right now i yeah so um you could you could um prank someone by watching some other videos like on youtube so yeah thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this video please read it read it five stars and yeah thanks for watching bye